In this topic, we are going to look at another aspect of this uh, designing an effective uh, repatriation program, uh, and that is uh, the establishment of a mentoring relationship. Um, in the previous topic, we discussed about the various topics on which the organization can work upon uh, to achieve an effective repatriation process. Uh, mentoring is a a uh, standalone process of uh, achieving a repatriation um, effectiveness and uh, it is standalone because it covers all the topics uh, which can be covered in an effective repatriation program so assigning a mentor to an international assignee can actually cover all the topics that we have discussed in the previous uh, in the previous topic uh, and can be taken care of by the mentor uh, himself or herself. Uh, and uh, that can also be done in combination with the organization working on various different topics of the repatriation process and the mentor looking after various different uh, aspects of the repatriation process. So uh, the mentoring uh, relationship is a standalone uh, aspect of, the, uh, of uh, ensuring an effective repatriation process. What is mentoring? Mentoring, you know very well, is the assigning of a mentor, a person who uh, looks after the person, uh, looks after the employee personally. So some organizations, they assign a mentor, also called a sponsor, to expatriates. And you would remember from the previous topics in which we were talking about the repatriation process, that the mentor or the sponsor is assigned at the pre-departure level. So before the person is going on the international assignment, the person is assigned to that, that, okay, this person is going to be your mentor sitting in the headquarter position and looking after the well-being and benefit of the person while the person is away. So mentor is a person who keeps contact. Uh, mentor is usually a senior person and knows the expatriate personally why it is a senior person because there has to be a significant gap between the level in which the person the employee and the mentor exists because if you assign a mentor at the same level they would be competitors and definitely competitors cannot look after the well-being uh, of uh, of each other because obviously they have uh, claims to the similar uh, goals uh, so uh, that is why the mentor has to be somebody in a senior position jisko is baat se na farak padta ho ke agar ye promote ho jayega to main nahi hunga so this is something which is an important aspect of the mentoring relationship it should be a senior person and then it should be the person who knows the person personally this is to overcome the uh, out of sight out of mind syndrome wohi jo maine last time bhi baat ki thi के आंख हो जल पहाड़ हो जल इसी को अगर इंग्लिश में आप बोलें तो दैट इज आउट ऑफ माइंड आउट आउट ऑफ साइट आउट ऑफ माइंड कि आप आंखों से दूर चले जाएं तो आप जहन में ही नहीं रहते तो इस सिंड्रोम को ओवरकम करने के लिए कि कोई एक मेंटोर अगर आपको हेडक्वार्टर्स में होम कंट्री में असाइन कर दिया जाए जो आपके आपकी वेल बींग को इंश्योर करे ताकि आप अपनी ऑर्गेनाइजेशन के हेडकोर्टर्स में आपकी एग्जिस्टेंस even it uh, if it is intangible existence but aapki existence kaim rahe um, it also helps in information sharing on regular basis so aapko ye pata chalta rahe ke uh, organization mein headquarters mein kya ho raha hai uh, mentor also includes uh, ensures inclusion in important decisions regarding promotions and positions so um, agar aap uh, apni organization ki if you move away from your workplace so different promotion uh, opportunities aati hain different positions ki opportunities aati hain to agar aap wahan pe maujood nahi hain to aapko information nahi milegi aapko uske bare mein pata nahi lagega aur aapko koi advocate karne wala nahi hoga aapko koi koi aapki bare mein jo hai wo usko recommend karne wala nahi hoga ke okay this is the position which is coming up this is the promotion opportunity which is coming up जिसके ऊपर इस इंटरनेशनल uh, असाइनी को भी कंसिडर किया जा सकता है सो मेंटर इज अ पर्सन हु फिल्स दिस गैप एंड ही इंश्योर्स दैट यू आर इंक्लूडेड इन द प्रमोशन एंड पोजीशनिंग एस्पेक्ट्स इफ समथिंग कम्स अप
Uh, and from uh, if if a mentoring relationship is established well, it has a significant impact on the performance of the individual. A study found that 40 out of 50 employees had experienced a mentoring relationship, and they said that their management position, which they were on at that particular time, the mentor had a significant contribution to that development. Uh, in a 2008 survey, it was found that 22% of the firms indicated the use of mentors for the repatriation process. Uh, we have discussed uh, generally what the mentor do, but let's specifically, uh, you know, talk about what should be the mute, uh, the duties of a mentor. Uh, first of all, is maintaining contact with the expatriate throughout the assignment. So, contact rakna jo hai. throughout the period of assignment is the first and foremost duty of the mentor then ensuring expatriates are kept up to date with developing uh, with developments in the home country so this is also part of the communication uh, regular communication that whatever the updates are that are taking place in the home country they should be communicated to the expatriates then ensuring expatriates are retained in existing management development programs uh so the development of management which is taking place at the headquarters at the parent country level uh the mentor makes sure that the uh expatriates are also included in the management development program uh, uh meaning that uh, the the plans that the organization has about the management development of its people ki aapke logo ne organization mein kis tarah se राइज करना है उसमें एक्सपेट्रिएट्स की जो जिनको आपने इंटरनेशनल असाइनमेंट्स में भेजा हुआ है उनके बारे में भी प्लानिंग जो है उसके अंदर उनको इंक्लूड किया जाए कि इनकी मैनेजमेंट डेवलपमेंट किस तरह से होगी सो मेंटर का एक ये भी ड्यूटी है एंड देन बीइंग रिस्पॉन्सिबल फॉर असिस्टिंग एक्सपेट्रिएट्स विद द रीपेट्रिएशन प्रोसेस इंक्लूडिंग असिस्टिंग दैम टू अपटेन अ रीपेट्रिएशन पोजिशन सो एज आई सेट दैट द मैंटोर कैन लुक आफ्टर all of the topics that were discussed in uh, designing an effective repatriation program or he can take the responsibility of few of them and the rest of them can be look, looked after by the organization but mentor has to play a very important role in the repatriation program and then because he is at a uh, he or she is at a senior position uh, they make sure that the person who comes back after the international assignment gets a position and a good position when he is repatriated back to the home country so these are the different types of duties of a mentor that uh, he can serve uh, uh, for a person who is sent on an international assignment and therefore can ensure an effective repatriation process of an expatriate